Hey guys, welcome back again to another technology guru video. Today I have a really neat tutorial that I want to show you. It is within Adobe Photoshop CS6. It is how to create a rainbow eye, okay? Uh, I've shown you how to create different colors of the eye to change the eye color, but today I'm going to show you how to create a nice rainbow effect within the eye. So the first thing that you need to do is go ahead and get a you know the eye pulled up whether you zoom in on one of your current pictures or if you just want to test this on an image you pull off the internet go ahead and bring that image up the first thing that you want to do is create a new layer so what you want to do now is go down here to your new layer tab in your layers panel by clicking on that there and that will create your new layer for you now the next thing that you want to do is grab your paintbrush tool which is right here and it could be hidden under a few other tools there so just click and hold down to make sure that is not the case the next thing you want to do is change the color of your brush to be a nice bright color so all of these colors that you're going to be using within the eye you want them to be nice and bright to get that really cool rainbow effect and then click OK now this is very important you want your brush to be fairly big so you can hit the right bracket key to increase that brush size okay and the left bracket key to decrease the brush size so make sure the brush is almost as big as the width of the eye there you do not want to get into the pupil and you do not want to get into the exterior of the white there of the eye so I have a nice brush size that I've selected here and I'm going to paint a nice selection just like that so now that I've done that there okay I want to go and select another color okay so I'm going to select another color so make sure it's a nice you know lavender or bright pink color uh, I'm gonna go ahead and select a bright yellow color and I'm going to do the same exact thing again you do not want it to get into the pupil like I did there so just undo that decrease the size of your brush and go ahead and do that now now the next steps I'm going to speed up a little bit because you're going to be doing this all around the eye so you're gonna select different colors and you're gonna paint little dots all around the inside of the eye so I'm gonna go ahead and fast forward to the next step all right and once you have the different colors all placed around the eye if you notice how I did this here you do not want too much of the eye showing because it will show through the original color so if you have to kind of fill in the gaps there with smaller circles to kind of fill in what you have not done so I'm gonna go ahead and I got one more here that I want to do that I'm gonna fill in with a nice blue color and I'm gonna do that by shrinking my brush just like so just like that now the next step that you want to do is you want to go and make sure you have that layer selected where you've colored the different colors around the eye and then you want to go up to filter blur and go down to Gaussian blur just like that now the radius the sweet spot that I have found is right around 6.5 to 7 so I'm gonna leave mine right at 6 point uh, let's say 6.8 and then click OK that will blur the colors against the eye the, the last step that you're going to take is select that layer once again and go up to the blend mode which should be set to normal and change that to overlay now that has blended into the eye very well now this is the end of you know the tutorial but if you do have any color on the outside of the eye here grab your eraser tool and start erasing that okay because this is above your background layer which is the image you will not erase anything you know to a transparent background you'll just erase that color that you may have gotten on the outside there so I really hope you enjoyed this tutorial this is a really neat trick you can do within Photoshop you can really wig your family out by giving some of them rainbow eyes in your next Christmas portrait I hope you really learned something from this tutorial if you have any questions however put them in the comment box below subscribe to my channel for more great content such as this like this video share it with your friends and I will see you guys next time.